Hey guys, what is going on? Silverlight Gaming HD here, back with another episode of our Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke, or Nuzlocke, uh, Randomizer, yeah, whatever, <laughs> you guys get the point. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, finally back for another part, getting this stupid thing to work was hell, seriously. But, um, actually last time, I don't actually, what did we do last time? We did some exploring, I think we got a new team member, maybe, maybe not. Actually, maybe we just ran around, uh, the city or whatnot and just checked it out. But basically, uh, we discovered that, uh, actually, um, a friend of mine commented on one of the videos and informed me that Grimer, unfortunately was caught in the same route as Doduo. Uh, we did actually catch him. Uh, we caught Doduo in route, I think it was 114 or something like that, uh, on the southern side of Petalburg Woods, but then we went through Petalburg Woods, and when we got on the other side, I thought it was a new route, uh, but it wasn't. Apparently it was the same route. I don't know why they did that. That's actually really lame. But whatever, so there goes Toxic. Technically we already lost our first Pokemon, but I guess not really. Uh, I don't know what to call this box. Just like... I'll just call it dead, even though I guess I caught it and now he's just dead. We'll just, yeah. Dead. So we only have one in there. Hopefully it stays like that. You know, I honestly, I think I should just release him or something. Anyway, so this episode we said we would be taking on the gym leader and I'm also gonna get off topic here uh, on a couple of notes. So first off, I really, really enjoy this playthrough. I think it's really, really fun, and I'm really, really excited to be back doing it, and I hope I can get the software working for good, because goddamn, this playthrough is my life. Seriously, it's the best. Anyway, so, honestly, I feel that way about all my playthroughs, though. I love making videos. I just think it's the best. It's, like, the funnest thing ever. But, um, also, I'm looking at my desktop background right now, and it is Majora's Mask, and god damn, I bought 3D, Majora's Mask 3D, and I've been playing it non-stop. I bought it the day it came out, and I already have like 30 hours played on it. God damn. <laughs> it's some tough amazingness. I don't even know. It was just really sick. Anyway, so here we're gonna take on the first trainer of the gym. Be very afraid, because this guy, I have no idea what he's gonna have. Skip Loom. All right, all right, that's cool. Uh, yeah, we could probably just use Vice Grip. I kind of want to speed this up because I'm just I gotta go fast. <laughs> that could be many things, but um, yeah. So yeah, I'm really actually excited to get back into making YouTube videos uh, because you know I've I mean I <laughs> I have free time, but I don't have free time because I have school still. But my out of school unfree time is no longer not free. If that made any sense whatsoever. But uh, after this video, I'm probably going to have to run through 3D World again and go through uh, World 2 that I just uploaded, I think, uh, this weekend? I'm not really sure. I'm going to have to go back through it, though. That's going to suck. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. All right, that's not a good pair up. All right, uh, here I'm gonna switch you out <laughs> for Octo Pops, and we'll have Doduo the Doduo murder this. That maybe that wasn't a good idea. Now that I think about it, shat, <laughs> crab. <laughs> Don't kill me, Dugtrio. Don't know like Rock Slide or something like that, please. <laughs> Shit. I didn't think about that. Plus, no. Okay. Alright, that's not even threatening. Uh, yeah, I'll probably just take this kid out. And I'm just a switcherooski master, man. I'm just, like, whipping everything in and out, getting everything experience. Yeah. Go Psy, got the big guns out now. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, unfortunately, we just got growled. The reason I'm not speeding this up is because... Now that I think about it, this is going to be a pretty short video anyway, uh, just because we're going to run through the gym, and then we're probably going to just end it off and leave it nice and short and sweet, and then the next video we'll be covering stuff like 
over to do for it and all that and you know I love this game can I also mention I loved Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire so much that I played it so much and like to the point where I can't play it anymore like, I don't know if you've ever played a game to the literal point where like just thinking about it is like sickening that's how much you outplayed it that is literally how I feel about that game. I love it, and I want to play it. Like, I want to pull it out and go catch all the legendaries and stuff, and I can't. I just can't, because I I don't, like, I don't want to, but I do want to. It's conflict within myself. <laughs> oh, goodness. Anyway, yeah, so... I think my nose is stuffy. It's not really, but it kind of is at the same time. And my room is messy. Like, I'm sitting in here, and it is really freaking messy. And the reason for that is because, like I said, I've just been playing Majora's Mask 3D all weekend. Haven't really moved. Should probably clean it. I'm going to see a movie in, like, 20 minutes. Should probably get ready. It's, it's six, in the, 6 in the evening, and I'm still not ready. That's what I get for having uh, a Sunday Monday, I guess. Because, technically, this Monday was a PA day. And... Now it's technically a Sunday, and this is what I do on Sundays, even though this is what I did on yesterday, too, and the day before that. <laughs> this weekend was great, because I just got to sit back and relax, not worry about homework or anything, and school, just relax, you know, spend the entire weekend jamming out on Majora's Mask 3D, which was so great, and there were things I was thinking, I've been thinking about. So, I was thinking about buying Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask on, like, that virtual console type thing for the Wii U, but, like, on the Wii kind of thing. Like, you know, you can switch between. I'm pretty sure if I switch to Wii menu, I can go into the eShop or whatever and buy Majora's Mask and Ocarina of Time. Both the N64 versions, that is. And then, maybe what I was thinking about doing is I was thinking about buying those and just doing... A playthrough like that of both of them uh, at some point you know because as even though everyone wants to see the 3d versions and 3d is the best uh, I don't have a 3ds capture card nor do I have the money to spend on a 3ds capture card and even if I did have that kind of money I don't think I would want to be spending it on a 3ds capture card just because <laughs> like I want to buy a gaming PC and I don't really have a big enough audience to be blowing about like $500 on a 3DS capture card like not now <laughs> maybe in the future if my subscriber base gets bigger and people say they want it yeah I'll do it but not now and I'm not even oh okay anyway so yeah I'm thinking about doing that just have the N64 versions but like over the Wii and record it like that um, yeah and that'd be pretty cool um, I want to say let me know, but I don't think anyone's going to let me know, so I'll just make that an executive decision on my behalf. So I'm just looking behind me. Um, but yeah, so I've pretty much just been sitting here talking in front of the gym leader. Uh, here we go. We're at the gym leader right now. So I'm actually kind of afraid, because I don't know what she's going to have. Uh, she might... Uh, oh yeah, I also started playing Link to the Past, um, because I never, like, I had it, but I just, something about it I found really confusing at, at the first part, I, I don't know, I got, like, lost in Hyrule Castle or something like that, <laughs> and I beat a link, a link Between Worlds, like, so bad, I just destroyed that game, I wrecked it, like, fully did everything, 100%, max out rupees, best heroes, tunic, it's all red, and purple upgraded sword and all that bull crap I just I went crazy with that game so uh, yeah anyway <laughs> I might be doing a playthrough that too I'm just I'm thinking lots of YouTube <laughs> hello I'm Roxanne the Rustboro Pokemon gym leader I don't know if people like me reading this because you can read right maybe I won't maybe I'll just be quiet for this Alrighty, here we go. Leader Roxanne would like to battle. Oh, shit. I don't think I'm prepared for that. Well, sure as hell not with that. <laughs> shit. I don't think... <laughs> Frick. Okay, uh... Alright, you know what? 
Yes. Alright, I I want to speed this up because I can't handle how slow these freaking games are. And with the with the idea that I can speed it up... Alright, that did a pretty decent amount of damage. I'm pretty sure that does more... Dash at... It's fast. Oh my... Oh my god! Okay, I thought our starter was gone there for a second. I was like, no. <laughs> okay. Shit. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna call. <coughs> okay. Uh, I don't know if... Do we have super potions or what, what the hell is that? Okay, we do have super potions. Okay. I should have put the quick claw on him. <laughs> this is so scary. Okay, good. He's using swift. That still did a... 12 damage. I mean, that's a lot early game. Okay. Don't kill me, please. Oh, the critical hits. What is this bitch? <laughs> okay. Jesus Christ. Don't have an electric type Pokemon. Okay, that's not bad. Yeah, we can take that thing out, I think. Alright, so I think that pretty much ends off this battle, hopefully. Oh, God. <laughs> I was No, she has three Pokemon. Why? Oh, we're gonna get wrecked. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing like a pedophile over here, because I'm pretty sure... Okay, good. I'm pretty sure we're about to get destroyed. So, I mean... Dawn fan. Oh. Okay. Crap. What? Why does she have such an overpowered team? I'm gonna have to, like... Oh, shit. Oh god. Oh my god, I hope every gym leader isn't like this. I mean, later on in the game, I guess it won't really matter that much. <laughs> We're screwed. It's a good thing Dawn Fan's really slow. Please don't use, like, Earthquake or something. Oh, Don't do that much, please. Shit, 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 shit. Fuck. What are we gonna do? There's nothing to do in this situation. Fuck. <sighs> Crap, we're gonna have to like sacrifice someone. I don't trust this. I'm not gonna survive another earthquake, and I, I honestly don't trust Octa Octillery. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if Needle's gonna survive one. I'll send out Psy. Shit. <laughs> Double edge. Oh my god. Okay. Um. What to do, what to do, what to do, what to do, what to do. Um, could he survive an earthquake? Let's be real here. Could he survive an earthquake? Why didn't I buy any potions? Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, we're gonna have to use one of these. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Please, 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 it's totally gonna kill me, it's gonna kill me. Ah, oh, okay. Oh my god. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. We can do this, we can do this. Jesus. No! Oh no, please, no. Please. Oh my god, he survived. Please, 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 please. please. Oh shit. No! Oh my god. If we survive this, like... <laughs> Holy Christ. This is like, I don't even know what the hell I'm doing with my life right now. Uh, Doduo is flying, so that shouldn't affect him. Um, this pursuit. Okay, I think we can... Oh my god. Um, I think we can maybe get off with some Psycho Killer over here. Oh, for Christ! Okay. It's okay. Oh my... Holy sh... Okay. I think we got this. Oh my god, we did it! Oh! Holy crap. Oh my god, that is the scariest thing I've ever experienced. Okay, next time we are training way higher than that. I didn't think I would have to grind that hard, but holy crap. Okay, we lost two teammates technically this game. This episode, whoa, that was probably the most hardcore first gym leader I've ever fought in my entire life.
Seriously, that was ridiculous. She didn't even have one, like, crap Pokemon. She had Parasect, which is, I guess, alright. But still, it's fully evolved. And then she had Dawn Fan. Like, really? Really? I thought I was gonna lose my starter there or something. It's a good thing we had freaking Seismic Pinsir. Otherwise, we would've been screwed. I can't believe we lost Hypno. I mean, I can't believe that. Hypno is my cool kid. I like that guy. <laughs> God damn. Hypno. No. Alright, so before we run into any cool kids, yeah, get out of the way! God damn it. Team Aqua, this guy's like, wait, my goods! <laughs> my goody goodies, come back, kid. <laughs> I like how these guys are just constantly jacking this guy's stuff. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and heal her up. Heal her up. And now we're going to deposit yet another Pokemon into our dead box. That, that sucks. That really sucks. I really wish that didn't happen. It kind of had to happen, though. I mean, it kind of had to happen. That's tough, though. That's a tough one. Ha, ha, ha. Anyway. You know what? Actually, I'm going to cover something in this video, because I don't feel like next video should just not include anything here. We're just going to leave next video. So... Yeah, 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 yeah. So we already know what's going on here. Okay, stop talking. Alright, so... Definitely needing to stock up on potions. Kinda wish I had that grow vial now. I kept finding over here. Even a Talo wouldn't have been a good choice, so I'm kinda glad. Alright, so... Yeah, yeah, your darling Pico. That's the guy. That's the guy. He's a cool kid. Alright, oh! not get fucked by that, please. Um, what's super effective on dark again? Fighting? Alright, so we have to fight this guy. He probably has a Poochina. Oh, he has a Togetic. Oh yeah, I forgot. It's randomized. It's... Watch me just get, like, murdered by this freaking Togetic. Togetic's actually pretty damn OP, so I mean, I wouldn't even be... God damn! I didn't even be surprised. Anyway, took a tick died, you little bitch. Okay, so good thing that guy is dead. We don't have to deal with that anymore. So this is plain not right. This is but what? Th you're stealing some guy's Pokemon and some other guy's goods, okay? You want it back badly, take it. Yeah, those Devon goods are mine. Silver put away those Devon goods. Cool. And now this guy's like, man, you salved my bird. Thanks. They call me Mr. Briny, and you are? Yeah. Yeah, alright. So yeah, just some quickness, just to uh, get us set up for the next video, because I personally... Okay, no. Oh! Damn! It's a good Pokemon. It's one of my favorite Pokemon, actually. I have a lot of favorite Pokemon. I don't know if I've ever mentioned that, but like, every fire Pokemon, Pokemon is basically my favorite Pokemon, so... Uh, so, what am I doing? Oh yeah, so this is just getting us set up for the next video, because we're not going to be hanging around here for any longer. Uh, we're going to be piecing out to somewhere new and better. Oh, how did it go? The Devon Goods. You did. What? <laughs> you got them back. Yeah, I am a great trainer. Thanks, man. And he's going to give me another Great Ball. Why don't you give me, like, five Great Balls? Because seriously, these Great Balls don't do crap. <sighs> Alright, so our president's office is on this floor. Anyway, I can't tell you how much I'm grateful for what you've done. By the way, that parcel you got back for us, could I get you to deliver it to the shipyard in Slateport? It would be awful if those robbers tried to take it again. You know what, dude? Why don't you deliver it? Bitch. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Of course I'll deliver it, because I'm a cool kid. Please go ahead. Alright. Don't mind if I do. I'm Mr. Stoned. <laughs> the president of Devon Corporation. I just got word about you. Okay, I'm not gonna read this. I'm pretty amazing, thanks. I 
yeah, isn't Steven his son or something? Oh yeah, we're gonna have to catch something in there. Does does the different floors of the cave count? Like, if I were to catch a Pokemon on the top floor and then like the basement floor, could would that count or would it just be one per the cave? Which honestly, that's what I think. But you know, it'd be cool actually, because now now you're not limited to just great or to just Magikarps for old rods. So I could just fish an old rod and pull out like a freaking Whale Lord or something. <laughs> it's a Pokemon Navigator or Pokenav for short. It is an indispensable tool for any trainer on an adventure. It has a map of the Hoenn region. You can check the locations of Dewford and Slateport, Slateport easily. By the way, I've heard that sinister criminals Nagma and Aqua, I believe, have been making trouble far and wide. Oh sweet, so he heals me up. Which wasn't really necessary, but cool. I'm not even mad. So quickly, once again, another little quick thing that before we end off the video, just because I don't want to be stuck in Rustboro any longer with the lingering idea of my murdered friends <laughs> from Roxanne. Let me see that. Okay, I don't care. Match call. I don't even. He's probably gonna force me to call someone anyway. Um, this is like the most useless feature ever. Seriously, like, did anyone actually use this? Like, I guess. They made it better in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, I'm pretty sure, but in this game, it really wasn't that helpful. Like, I think you could use it to call people in rematch, but I never even used it, besides, like, when you had to call people. Anyway, alright, that's cool. Alright, so yeah, just, I'm really gonna quickly run into the, really quickly going to run into the Pokemart. Pretty sure you can fight Mei there if you want, but, uh, we're not gonna do that yet. Actually... Nah, no, we're not we're not prepared for this. <laughs> so how many Pokeballs do we have? So we need to buy two super potions. Actually we'll buy five. Oh no, we only have three thousand bucks. We'll buy two. And we'll buy five of these. And we'll buy a couple Pokeballs. And there we go. That's just what I wanted to do, so I don't have to do it in the beginning of the next video. So now, and next time, we'll be perfectly set to just leave this place and go to a better one. So thank you guys for watching this episode of my Nuzlocke Randomizer. I'm pretty sure at the beginning of this, I was bitching about how it's actually a randomized Nuzlocke or something like that. And that it wouldn't be right to call it a Nuzlocke Randomizer or something like that. I don't really care anymore. Um... <laughs> I don't really think I care that much to begin with, but uh, anyway, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, make sure to, s s uh, I was going to say slap the like button, but I wasn't sure if that was weird. <laughs> Alright. I know. That's awkward. Probably going to edit that out. Oh, we are leaving in 15. Crap. Alright, well... If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.